Hello, and welcome to Haunt, a Thief 2 fan mission by Balboa. Doesn't have any uh, briefing text, so uh, let's bask in this calming ambience while I read out the uh, sorry, briefing video, so let's read out the briefing text. An abandoned manor, long since fallen into disrepair, and once the home of a wealthy hammer. Locals claim that the manor is haunted and that no sane man would go there. Haunted? <laughs> Can't be worse than the Bone Horde. Plus, a manor that scares everyone away is likely to still have a considerable amount of loot waiting to be found. Make it yours. I will make it mine. Alright. Let's, uh, begin. Let's do my usual go on hard instead of expert, because I don't know whether we're going to have any... Expert no-kill objectives. I mean, it's gonna be... You shouldn't expect humans here, right? Let's try expert. Ah, yes. Uh, long since fallen in the bear. Find a way inside. A uh, considerable amount of loot waiting to be found. A steel to 3500. And return to where I entered the manor grounds. Oh, cool, we get a shop. I always like missions with a shop. So a nice start. Uh, what do we have to begin? We've got one rope arrow, that's bare minimum. Six broadheads, three waters. Hmm. I'm gonna need, we've got, oh, only 250. I'm gonna say, we're probably gonna need another healing potion, right? Uh, I don't have much choice here. I think the healing potion, I mean, the moss would be useful as well. I could get two moss. Moscow Void, I really don't know what I'm gonna need. This is a very, very small supply of stuff for expert, even for expert. Uh, and only 250 to spend is not a lot. Um, I'm sure I will need this because I'll probably just take full damage and I don't want to be quick loading it all the time. So we'll manage as we can with everything else. I will be quick saving to avoid breaking rope arrows from bad uh, rope arrow shots, but, you know, I don't typically save scum apart from that. So, let's try and hope that the rest of the equipment's enough to deal with uh, whatever we encounter. That's only going to be loot, right? It's not going to be anything spooky. Why would there be anything spooky? Alright. Let's... Have a look at this place. I mean, it's a surprisingly bright evening, really. Is that a frog beast? Sure looks like it. I will have to surprise. I don't expect to see them outside of the Trickster's domain. I think there's another one. I think I heard a second one. Yeah, there's one just sitting there. Okay. I can see another, another moss arrow on the far side of the pond, so we'll sneak around and grab that. Good thing I didn't spend my money on moss arrows. Thinking two moss arrows would be... Uh, Would have been, you know, most arrows are potentially useful. Could have been one thing to uh, spend more money on. Okay, we have a back door. Do we have a map, actually? We do not. What side am I I'm on the western side? Okay, we've got the door on the western side. Which is maybe a way in. Let's uh, keep that in mind. Those tree beasts? Okay, this place has got something funky going on. This guy was not a hammerite, surely. There's a hammer sign over the door there. Maybe he just was a really, really bad hammerite and. Okay, there's greenhouse on the north. Door it normally has two uh What 
Wait a minute, I can hear footsteps. Oh, there's a fucking tree beast walking around out there. Okay, well, uh, this place is definitely not as safe as one might expect. The front door is just... Can't go this way. Yeah, it's not going to be doable. All right. Something we've done full circle, yes. All right. Well, we've got two choices. As far as I can see, unless we can get up somewhere. I don't see any other way ob obvious to climb. That door leaves me in the light, so I don't want to do that. Let's go. Let's try this door. Near yeah, these uncomfortable fellows. Oh, actually, maybe we can climb this. Let's try climbing. That's oh, quite slippery. Yeah, okay. That's not going to work. I haven't seen any opportunities for roping either, so let's just try and get in this door. That's not my lockpicks. That should do it. Although... Having these mushrooms letting me up here is not so cool either. Well... Oh. That just lit itself. They all did that. Fucking hell, they do. I was gonna say, objective one complete, all we're gonna do now is do objective two. Uh, steal stuff, but these torches are laying themselves, which is, gotta say, remarkably rude of them. They're not super bright, though. I could stand here and still be quite well hidden, so. That means I'm gonna have to be careful about. I think that was my mouse double clicking rather than the. Shoot. What's going on there? A window or a mirror? That's a mirror. Yeah, my right mouse button, there seems to be, uh, having problems. Can we break it? Don't worry about it here, right? Very strange to have complete darkness below a torch, but, uh... I'll take it. Okay, we've got it upstairs, we're downstairs. It's a kitchen, I guess? And that's why we came in. Dining room, not kitchen. Was once... Wait, maybe not a dining room? Had a hammer chap, what's got pews? Why they got a bricked up doorway? On the western side, just near where we came in, but... Odd. God, my mouse is freaking me out every time a door closes in my face because of my uh, accidental double click. I need to get it fixed. Oh, something happened here. Blood stain? It kind of looks like it's leading under that door. Well, it's just another mirror. Not 
not sure I want to touch the body. Statues and books are not not valuable. What about the one he's carrying on him? The journal. Brother, if thou read this, know that I have perished. But do not grieve, for I now rest in peace eternal with the Master Builder. Think rather on the fate of your own soul, for you are truly doomed. Your objectives. Think on the fate of my own soul. No, find out what happened here. Okay. Very unlike Garrett to be uh, self-reflecting. Uh, what happened here is someone took everything out of the safe. That's not good. That's a nice, nice shelf supports there. <laughs> yeah. Not a single thing in here. I'm annoyed that I can't use the safe door. I can't, I'm annoyed that I can't pick up the, the junk. I don't want to get close to the body, it's probably fine, but I will continue my cautious exploration. Alright, let's leave this door for a little bit. Let's check out the rest of this floor. This room looks safe enough. I could swear that torch didn't light up until I looked at it. Plate under there. Safe enough, but not exciting. Oh, lit candle in the bathroom. Okay, nothing, nothing exciting here. I'm gonna have to be careful with. Uh... That's where I was before, right? Yeah. I didn't notice those bottles, but I can't pick them up, so I guess they don't matter. Be careful with throbbing uh, anything. But, uh... Okay, basement access here. Any consumables like flash bombs or anything, you might end up double throbbing. Bottle. Some larger mason jar or something. Wooden bowl, nothing, nothing here. Honestly, this is almost cheery for a haunted house. Guess we check out the basement. Hmm. Well, yeah, okay. Check it out shortly. Rats chilling out in the wine cellar. Or barrels missing. Probably not spookily, just just. They drank drunk their wine. Another dead hammer. General Brother Sanger. Could go, he seems invitable, walking the corridors of his manor. Our hammers have faced him not at all, nor has he been diminished by our most holy waters. Before I took vows, I was known to possess nimble fingers. By chance, I spied upon his person an amulet that glowed with an eerie luminescence. I snatched the medallion from his waist, and to my amazement, he vanished from sight. Did that talisman give him the power to walk amongst the living? Alas, not completely. For Gregarious can still brief appear briefly amongst us. Indeed, he did so, and struck me most grievously before fading again. I am fading fast, and will soon shed this mortal coil, but I cannot allow Gregarious to regain his amulet. Before I die, I must hide it where he cannot find it. Well hidden indeed, methinks. Well hidden. I wonder if that might be a very well-constructed clue. Okay, I'm going to assume that you're just dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
can assume you're just dead, that you're not going to be zombie. Hmm. Well, I guess it's leading me to the well. Question is, do I scout the rest of the house? I've got a whole upstairs to scout. You know what, let's, let's... Let's not, let's not play it safe and, and know what we're dealing with. Let's just go swimming. We don't even want to go swimming, it's right here. Your objectives. Uh, it seems that the locals are right. The manor is haunted after all, and you are trapped inside. Escape if you can. How do I suddenly know I'm trapped inside? That's... Pretty smart thinking there, Garrett. Suddenly know that picking up an amulet traps you. Doesn't sound like anyone started uh, messing about out here. Oh, yes, it does. There's somebody else walking around. Can I check that door? I think I did, right? Can't tell if there's somebody moving or if the doors are just opening and closing by themselves. Also, I'm hearing doors that I don't know where they are, which is also disconcerting. Alright, I, I still have my uh, loot goal. Upstairs. More mirrors. These doors do not seem to suggest somebody walking. If we can see some spot somebody walking around in the mirror that we can't see in real life. It would have to be opening one of these two doors, right? Well there's my answer. A torn page of music. Alright, Garrett can't read music well enough to make sense of that. I never could read music well. So I'm not gonna try. I guess what I'm going to do is proceed on the assumption that these doors are just being spooky feeling and not actually indicating a problem until I discover otherwise. Like, they're suddenly being murdered. Hmm, 
Okay. Can I say I'm doing that? But also not actually being consistent with my own suggestion. And be quiet and I end up jumping on the tile twice. Good work there, Kat. Good work. That's gold. I can't take the gold. What's what's up with that? Who? I'm sorry. I don't... Look, it's beautiful gold chamber pot. Sure it's clean. Nobody leaves it there once it's been used. So far, there's no sign of any actual loot I can take. Did I take that room? I did not check that room. Another dead hammer, right? See, this isn't, this clearly isn't somebody, a ghost wandering around, right? It's a door's possessed. Otherwise they would have walked back out again. What is going on here? They're pouring... I guess they're trying to forge, you know, cast some something out of metal and it's just all cold and... Broken mirror. Got the Einhorn. Having read through the scattered ramblings of Brother Gagarius, I see that he was truly mad. But there is a glimmer of hope for my brothers and I. Although these mirrors that Gregarius lurks behind are not harmed by our steel, they can be shattered by Gregarius's own hammer, with which he crafted those same mirrors. Do not ask me how you craft a, a mirror with a hammer, but uh, that is the way of it. I believe I have spied that same weapon above the altar in the chapel here. But the entrance to the chapel is bricked shut, and we have found no other entry therein. Alas, I am sundered from my brothers, and my injuries will soon prove fatal. Builder, guide my brothers to find these words, and let them thus prevail. Okay, so we went we went into that greenhouse door, right? Rick's door west of it is chapel. Machinery long since dead. I think we shall find nothing else of use in here. Upstairs then. Powerful banner. Let's try this one. Also too powerful for my sword. Oh hello. Is that another Is that another dead hammer, right? It does also seem to have dropped a journal, so I guess so. Just he died praying there at the altar. Somebody's going to work on these banners already. More mirrors. Brother Morgan. We, Brother Inquisitors, were dispatched to deal with Gregarius the Heretic, who was cast out of our order by the High Priest. Alas, we sorely misjudged the, whole, the unholy strength of Gregarius, 
for it has been four days since we were trapped within this evil manor. The Shade of Gregarious continues to walk the halls of his ancestral manor. He also walks behind the many mirrors as well, mocking us. I know not what arcane magics Gregarious has mastered, but her steel brings no harm to his shade, or to the mirrors he hides behind, or even the doors that prison us in this accursed manner. If we could but shatter those same mirrors, mayhaps we could banish Gregarious from the world of the living, and thus achieve our quest. Alas, I fear my brothers have all been slain by the haunt. Now I alone remain. Build a damn this accursed place. The torches relight themselves each day, doors open and close of their own volition, and the ghostly wailing of the haunt echoes through empty halls. Master Builder, purify my spirit, and look with favour upon my hammer. I await my fate. New objectives? Find out what happened here, I guess so. That amulet is the key to the mirror world, find it. Okay. Uh, I'm not sure when that turned up. You need that hammer to destroy the mirrors, find a way into the chapel and get it, yes. Using me up here from the painting, okay. There better be a whole lot of loot. Every time my Roman. Okay, did I go in this room? I guess not. Thanks for opening the door for me there. buttons. Red and grey and blue. Oh. What's that scrap? We had red and blue. Red, blue, blue, red, red. So one red, two blue, two red, three blue. So we start with red and go one, two, two, three. Whoops. Okay, that's that's some just some loot. All right. Well, that's that's the start. We better go find that chapel, I guess. It was the exterior door that led there, but... Are we not going to be able to find the exterior door? Get back out to it. Not. 
I guess we probably wouldn't have been able to get in that way either. Did you drop? Oh, so there were rooms here I had not been in. That's me not being as thorough as I should. think of one thing to do right now. I can't use this amulet. Okay, I was going to try putting it on and see if that lets me walk through the mirrors. Oh, I can just walk through them anyway. Okay. Pretty hard to see in here, though. So on the one hand, it's pretty hard to see. But on the other hand... Okay, there's still a dead end in this world, too. Root. Okay, that's perhaps useful. My compass is not... Well, I guess I wouldn't know if it was reversed east-west, right? work in this mirror world? Ah. Right, he lights the place up. He's not safe to be around. Fruits do heal me, though. Well, I was wrong about the fall damage, but right about needing the healing potion, I suppose. Basements in this world, then.
Oh, is he the one who died down here? This is, these aren't gregarious, these are the hammers whose bodies we found. I see. Is this guy lit up? I couldn't tell. Maybe that's what confused me. Maybe gregarious is the one who's lit up? Or maybe they all are, I don't know. Oh, he's definitely blowing. Right, I think I'm done with the basement. Before. This is not a good place to be. I don't know when he's, I don't know when he's coming back, so I kind of want to wait till he comes and goes again. He's guarding all the loot. Ah, the bathroom. So he comes through that door there, right? Clients out of the corner of my eye. Excuse me. Hmm, I'm gonna wait again.
have to see when he comes back. Shouldn't be too long, right? Doing okay for loot, there's gonna be more upstairs, of course. I'm gonna try and find that chapel. But again, this isn't gregarious, this is one of the I wonder if I can I wonder if these are just ordinary haunts. Oh, we should try the experiment. This experiment is not going the way that uh, it should have gone. Uh, Alright, let's not try that experiment again. Maybe there's a Gregarious himself, but if so there's more than one of them. So I think it's the same. I think it's just the brother whose body we found down here. Oh, this is the one with the door of the chapel. This is where I need to be. Oh, he's going into the chapel. He's going to come back out again. I don't know where he's going to go. Of course, loot is important. say above the altar. This is above the altar. Doesn't look to me like there's anything up here for me. Should be relatively safe if what's his name one is in here again. There's nothing in that window, is there? It does not seem to me that there is. Definitely nothing in that one. Let's try the crypt. Another set of stairs going up. Wait, what through here? I don't know where I am at all. I've not seen this part of the house at all. Color control panel has been stabbed. Hmm. Should be able to push the buttons though. Crypt. <laughs> There's a 
not been checking down beside these things as thoroughly as I should. But I guess there's probably no, uh, no valuables in here, right? Now if I could see through there to see if our friend was there. One of these goes up to that one goes up to the chapel. Where does this one go? Oh. Wait, wait, look, of course the chapel it's mirrored. So that's his hammer. It's up this way then. Right, let's see. Apart from the Stairs I can't walk up. That's the exit. That's that's what the exterior door would have taken us to. Okay. Straight to the crypt. You see what I see there? Yellow, red, green, blue. That's not the map. I don't suppose we can take this yet. No, it's, it's protected. And the holy water has run dry. <laughs> I guess I should be looking up here as well. In this version of the world. There is a cup there. It's a loot that somehow escaped the, uh, the notice of the eagles. Yes, indeed. How strange. They must have collected it by hand instead of magically. And the altar is broken. Do I need a piece of the altar? Oh no, that's just the shape of it. That way. Okay. But these buttons didn't seem to be usable to me. What was it? What was that? Sequence yellow, red, green, blue. Hmm. I can try this. There's a red one flickered when I uh, hit one of those there, so... No, that hit red. Red one moved. This doesn't seem right. I hit green. Also hit green. I hit yellow. Red. Green. I can actually hit them all, although it doesn't do anything. Alright, I'm going to uh, reload so don't waste my arrows there. I think whatever I'm doing there is not what's supposed to be happening right now. They're not supposed to be usable yet. What about this banner? Can I break this banner? No. So I have the amulets. That's what's letting me through the mirrors. It doesn't do me any good here. Is there anything in the other journals that helps me? That's the one about... My horn says about the hammer. Walric says... I am doomed. He's not very helpful, right? Sangar says... He seems invincible. He has the amulet. Um, blah, 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 I hid it in the well. Morgan trapped us here. He's mocking us. 
chance that the mirrors may ba may help to banish him. Yeah, yeah, okay. And that's it. Well, I do not have any uh, information then on what I should be doing here. Okay, well... I guess we can try going back out. I mean, so this is the exterior door, it's not going to open, right? Oh, the crypts there are going to have stuff in them, right? So we know how to get to there. We have to be wary because somebody does come into this chapel here. Okay. Don't know which route they take. We have to. Again, we're gonna have to be careful. Presumably, being undead, they will not need the bathroom. We can only hope. Oh, they've done these already. Sure, he comes in here. Yeah, we've seen him go in there.
Yes. <laughs> I think I'm also hearing doors upstairs, okay. Never met a door he didn't want to open into his face. Okay. Alright, am I down on this floor? I don't know. Yes. So we need to go upstairs. There's our friend. Just watch him. I think that room's a dead end, isn't it? No, it's not. Noisy in here. Still can't take it. Now I don't know where our friend is. Just going to that room, okay. No, he's going to that one. One valuable book. I think then further upstairs. sufficiently that's the bathroom okay you can chop these in this well did I ever go up to this floor? Yes. In the non narrow world, I mean. That's what I 
always find something. Let's open that door if I can. Following him is the best and safest thing here. Okay, as I, as I hoped, he did not come closer in than the doorway. Loot. Good time to save. into this room next. You just want to look like a corner. And just here as a right angle, all concave. Yeah, that's all in. I've done every rumor here. Hmm. You know, I found a way into the chapel, but I couldn't find a way to get the hammer. Alright, I guess we've got to find our way back to the chapel then. Our friend on this floor doesn't come up here, right? He's not here in our way right now. So what was the way to the chapel? We had to get into it from here. It was on the west side. It's going to be on the east side in this version, right? It was it was north and west. It should be north and east. I don't know which way it's reversed, actually. I guess it do. The mirrors are north and south. Uh, so it's going to be southwest? No, southeast. Not down this way. Of course, it's the main door. It's 
down that hallway. But I don't know where our friend from this floor is hiding. That would be him. Going back the way we wanted to go, that's not. Okay. Clear the chapel, so in which case. Is there anything on the rocks up here as well? Sorry, look, but you know, we can always double check. No, seems not. Is there? Just wait for him to move on. Or that that'll do. No, we need to get through the mirror, that's right. He sometimes stares at the mirror, so coming back through that mirror is gonna be quite dangerous. So these switches don't seem to work, and that's bothering me. Right. I don't know how... how we can fix this. Try hitting it. See if that fixes it. But it does not. And we're not getting out here. All right, well. Now let's go up and stare at the hammer. Okay, I understand what I have to do. The buttons have been destroyed in this version of the world, but in the mirror world, they are not. We need to make a note of their arrangement. Uh, so they go red, grey, purple. Yellow, green, blue, right? Okay, so uh, so if it's the one, two, three, four, five, six, then we have to press four, one, five, six, right? We just we we, we do them like this. That pattern. Okay. Let's hope he's not on the other side of here while we go when we go through. Okay. Well, that didn't work. I 
like whispering means he's near. Yes, it does. Ah! It does. Ouch. <laughs> it's the problem with being able to see through the mirror world, but not properly. <laughs> not actually see through. Have to wait for him to calm down, of course. <laughs> I can lean through this this bit of the mirror. Okay, he's angry, but he's not here. He's looking around for me. Hopefully he doesn't decide to search this way. Can't really see him. We try the pattern reversed. Yes, it went clunk. All right. Uh, I don't think it's supposed to. Something. Something seems weird there. It looks very long and thin in my hand, and oh, I see. I can swap them. But it also left left a hammer there floating, which seems wrong to me. But now we should be able to kill them, right? So even if he's here, we should be able to take him on. Oh. Nothing to these guys. Okay. Oh, hello. Secret passage. Where's this go? back in there with the hammer. What? But then what am I doing? He's passed.
He's angry, but he didn't find me. Uh, so I can't kill these guys with my sword then. So I have to check right on this guy. Okay, we just can't hit them with anything. I can't come in here. Okay, I don't know why I couldn't before. Alright. I was confused. So, one of our friends is still here. the exit, not the chapel. Right. So if we kill this spirit, it should kill the zombie version of it, right? Logically. Does logic even work when you're dealing with the undead? He does is stand there and watch for a bit. What the? Oh, we need to smash the mirrors on, on the fall. We just need to smash all the mirrors, we don't need to kill the zombies. That's why we have this passage here. Because otherwise we'd be trapped in this chapel and... So we wait till he walks away again, smash this mirror, and then work our way upstairs, smashing them all. Okay. Paid attention to those damn journals, right? The objective? Trap him in by breaking all the mirrors and be sure to collect all your loot before you shatter the final mirror. Well, we've got the loot goal, so yes. So we need to go out here to the right. I'm not surprised to find him here. Maybe he doesn't come in here? Okay, footsteps again. Yeah, this is the question. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Well, he's angry there. Doesn't seem to be very clear on exactly where the sound came from or what it was. I think that helps us.
fuck? How the, how the fuck did he see me? I guess I dealt with them. Front door is still closed. Guess we're going back out the way we came in. Yep. Escape if I can. Wait, is this where we came in? No. Is this. Well, oh, I'm all turned about now. See the greenhouse is the other side. I guess I got used to the mirror version of it. This, this hallway. No. Yes. This door. This door. Oops. Oops. What? Ugh, I forgot my sword. Stupid taffer. Oh. Oh, right. Can we get in this way then? If we can't... Okay, so thankfully I can. Uh, yeah, let's leave this hammer here. Never mind the floating spooky hammers. We've got the strange hammer too, I guess. I guess we can sell it, right? Nobody's gonna. It's not gonna cause anybody any trouble. We'll leave the frogs. We'll leave this cursed place. And go in and have a nice rest. So did we get 4,000 out of 5,200? Okay, we missed quite a bit there. I... That's an awful lot. That's a surprise to me, because I thought I was fairly thorough. I mean, I, sometimes I'm not. But this time I thought I checked every room and seen almost everything there was to see. I'm just trying to think where there could have been more loot hidden. I guess maybe there was some in the wine cellar I didn't take? I guess I was not thorough about the wine cellar. That be... There might be some bottles there. I can see that maybe I missed a few bits and bobs up in uh, other rooms. But, huh. Well. That was... Haunt. So, thanks so much for watching. And, uh, I will see you here soon for the next mission.